<laughs> so you guys, I'm in the mood. This is Sierra with um New City. It's hot. You guys gotta try it. Check it out. Um, let me turn it down so I can do this video for y'all. Cause you're gonna wanna really watch this. So I'm gonna turn it off. Okay, why isn't it turned off yet? Okay, there we go. This is um Monique coming at you guys today. I'm gonna do um. This is going to be my video for my natural homemade makeup remover. Um, I'm so excited to be doing this because, as you guys know, I'm a common positive but also an esthetician which specializes. I specialize in skincare. So I'm so excited to do this one with you guys today. Um, I'm doing this video, um, this natural homemade makeup remover, because I ran out. And I was like, well, I want to show you guys my remedy, my way, which is very, very effective. You guys will love it. Um, once I show you guys how to just do it, it's very simple. Um, it doesn't cost anything. It's very, very cheap to use. So check it out, you guys. Um, so I love I love to show y'all how y'all do it. So the things you're going to need, you're probably thinking, what do I need? Like I said, it's very, very um, inexpensive. So you don't have to worry about running out to the store to buy all these products to use. Um it's just two things extra virgin olive oil that's the first effective ingredient and a cup a half a cup actually you'll be using I have a cup of distilled purified water not tap water distilled purified water whether it's their part whatever as long as it's purified and distilled that's fine so that's all you need um, and of course the tool you're going to need is I'm going to use, um, see I ran out, I'm going to use my MAC, um, my MAC, I said MAC, MAC <laughs> bottle, it was an old, it used to be, um, of course you guys know, this used to be the MAC brush cleanser, so I use this because it has the, the snap top on it, so you're going to need this or a regular applicator bottle with the nozzle, that's fine, but you're going to need an applicator bottle, so I'm going to be using that, um, and if, who, and if you guys, you know, some, for those who out there that don't really know how much a half a cup is or how much to really use or, you know, you don't want to make it too watery, too oily, you can use measuring cups or some kind of measuring tool. These are my measuring cups. So I'm going to use it for, like, the water or whatever. So, like I said, that's all you guys need. Uh, that, I'm sorry. Extra virgin olive oil and water. So, um, some of you are probably thinking why are you using extra virgin olive oil. Um, first of all, extra virgin olive oil is very, very, very natural, you guys. Um, for those out there that use it on their hair, you already know how it is. Very, very moisturizing, very natural. It's, um, of course, um, a very, very high in antioxidant and high in vitamin E. Um, like I said, it's, it's excellent. So, um, for those who have dry skin, uh, sensitive skin, it's perfect for you. Um, those who have dry, normal to dry or combination, it's still excellent for you because it doesn't make your skin too oily. It doesn't clog your pores. It just cleanses your face. It's a natural purifier and cleanser. So, you guys will love it. Um, so, I'm going to show you guys how I, how I do it. So, you're going to take your top off the applicator bottle. And for this, like I said, you guys, um, you're going to need more oil than water. That's how you make the remover, the makeup remover. You're going to need one. Oh, you're also going to need some, um, to, to wipe the makeup off, you're going to need some um, cotton pad, um, some nice cotton pads. But I'm, I don't have any more, so I just folded up some tissue. Ghetto, huh? That's all I have. So I'm just going to show you guys with the folded up piece of tissue, um, soft piece of tissue, how to remove it and what happens. You know how it cleanses my skin once I take it off. So anyway, enough going on and on. Okay, the bottle. And you guys, like I said, of course, don't forget the the key in making this perfect makeup natural makeup remover is more oil than water. So you're gonna use a half a cup of water. Fill it to the top. Half a cup of 
of water, you guys. I'm going to pour it in there. Half a cup of water. Like that. That's a half a cup of water. And um, I'm going to be using this much because I need a whole bottle of makeup remover because as I saw, I use all. And uh, I'm going to use a cup because like I said, more oil than water. I'm going to use a cup of extra virgin olive oil. There's my oil in there. So you're going to want to pour at least a cup of oil. See that? So, like I said, you guys, more oil than water. So at least a cup, a half a cup of water and a um a cup of oil. That's how it looks. Of course, the oil consistency sits at the top because oil and water don't mix. You guys should know that. So the oil is gonna sit at, at the top. You put your nozzle on, shake it up. And like I say, guys, oh, this is such so good. It wipes every dirt makeup oil off. Um, it's so natural. You shake it up really, really good. And if you want to, um, I never do this because it cleanses my skin really, really good. But if you want to, you can always re-wash um, your face or re, you know, with a, a light um, cleanser. You can always, after taking your makeup off, you can always cleanse your skin again for extra cleansing um, to make sure all the dirt and residue is out your pores. So you can re-wash it if you feel like it's not that cleansed with this method. But I honestly have no problems, and I have nice, normal skin with just doing this. Um, so you shake it up really good. So it looks like this. So it'll be, when you see it, it'll be like yellowish. No worry, that's the oil. And the water mixed up. Shake it up a little bit more, that's how it looks. And there you go. And you want to want to check and see how it comes out. It should be watery, but um, a little oil to it. And you just wipe off all your makeup foundation. You can even use it to wipe off your lipstick. See that? Comes right off. And the only reason why my lips are pink is I have a lipstick that stains my lips, though. So. Flip it over. Continue to continue to wipe it off. Go underneath your neck, forehead, a nose. I'm just showing you guys how effective it is. See that? All that makeup and dirt. And if you have way more makeup on than me, you'll see it wipes right off. I love it. So that's my natural makeup remover. Um, I'll post I'll post all the um ingredients um at the bottom below and what you need to make this. And like I said, please try this, you guys. You'll love it. You don't have to go all buy expensive makeup removers or all these ingredients to make this stuff that you see on everybody else using. Just use this water, oil, perfect. Avocado bottle. Pay it to wipe it off. There you go. So, please um, rate, comment, and subscribe, you guys. I really want to know what y'all think. Um, I want to know if you do use it, how effective it is. And just let me know. I'm definitely waiting for you guys to tell me what you think. Thank you. Bye-bye.